So hello everybody and welcome to another Power BI video. In today's video I'm going to show you how you can sketch your Power BI reports remotely with your team in a very professional and quick way. Let's get started. Okay, so let me introduce you to sketched shapes. What is that? Well, it's something that Microsoft introduced for PowerPoint, Excel and Word. And it is a fantastic way for you to collaborate with your team remotely to design and sketch things. Like in this case, it is a web uh, report on, on a tablet size and also on a mobile size. And this is perfect for doing these for Power BI reports. So that's why I'm showing you here. I'm going to give you an example of how you can use these for designing mobile reports. Mobile reports is even more important to do it together with the team so they understand how small the screen is. So let me show you. So I'm going to post a link down below to this link so you can download the same resource, right? And also to the announcement so you can see everything. But they give you these, which is the final example, and then they give you, okay, try it yourself for a tablet and then try to search for a mobile. Now, I'm going to try these for mobile design because, again, for Power BI and teams to understand mobile design, it's good to actually see a mobile phone in front of you. So let's say that you created a report, right? And then they say, okay, we want a mobile design. Gather your team, gather your customers on a team call, and then I'll say, okay, this is the report that we had before. Now we're going to convert it to mobile. Now mobile is small screen, so let's do it together. So you have, for example, uh, you have here some stuff like you see that you can copy paste into your mobile and do like reports very quickly. You have here some assets too, you see, and then there are some assets in here too, basic toolkit. So let me show you. So you have like placeholders, images and, you know, icons and things like that. So buttons and that is super cool. So if we go in here and we say, okay, the first thing that we want is to have a title. Title. And then we said, okay, I would actually like to have a slicer of any kind. If the shape that you want is not in here, you can actually create it and then convert it to a shape and then you can convert it to a sketch. I think the shape outline here if you pick sketch it will convert to a sketch otherwise it will convert it you see so it's quite cool so if you were for, would like for example to have the power bi slicer you can do that or you can just pick that and then just i copy the icons from power bi these are the old icons i have to update this <laughs> so here so this is a search we're going to first search by country and then you say, okay, I would like to have, do you remember that we created a, a table with all of the customers that we had for, so you put in there. So you say, okay, you see that if we put a table, it needs to be a big table and it's going to take all the spaces that they want first. Ah, uh, no, maybe I would like to have first some KPIs, right? So I would like to have the number of, Sales by product. Sales year to date. So you'll get there, and then we put here we want to have, um, I don't know, sales versus previous year. Now we have the two icons, and then we want to put some text that says, this uh, report summary text of whatever you guys decide that it should be and then you want to have a line chart in there that will show sales trend okay by year for example 
and there you have the alt text so you can click on it and you can actually see what you decide that that thing will be and this way you together with the team can actually start to imagine how that report would look like which i think is quite nice another thing that you could do is to actually use these to design the entire report i wouldn't necessarily say like put a line chart here and i want a pie chart or mm, because you have to check your data first to see what type of visualization you should use but you could have these to design the structure of your report i would like for example a summary a hr report i would like to have a summary i would like a page for salaries another page for and you can just you know together with these do it and then i would like to have a they have like video format in here i think it was in there but i deleted it <laughs> so you can put a video there where you welcome people to the dashboard whatever right and then you can do this on teams and you can actually use also whiteboard and paste these shapes on microsoft whiteboard and sketch it there and then convert it to shape later whatever works your boat will work okay so give it a go test it let me know what you think and uh, that's all for today i will see you again on friday with a dax writers video so until then take care and bye bye